Hey guys, Dino Zero. How you doing? Hope everything is well. Uh, okay, you can see I got a couple of little bottles of lube <coughs> in my sidearm here, which is uh, you know my tank folio. Um, what this video is about is not going to be about cleaning my sidearm, which is um, just I just cleaned it. I just oiled it and I just cleaned it. Uh, this video is going to be about slide slick the the lube. Uh, a dude got a hold of me, a dude named Buzzsaw, uh, got a hold of me and sent me a couple of these bottles. He manufactures this stuff himself. Buzzsaw is an outstanding, outstanding dude, man. Um, he lives in Connecticut, so he's fighting a good fight right now as far as the uh, Second Amendment rights go up there. Um, he is a firearms instructor uh, and it has been for many, 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 many years. Um, after the Sandy Hook tragedy happened, um, Buzz took it upon himself to take his uh, firearms knowledge and his training abilities, and he trained for free, free of charge, 47 teachers in the state of Connecticut to, uh, to get their concealed carry license uh, so that they can keep themselves and their children safe. And I think that is just awesome, Buzz. You rock, brother, for doing stuff like that. Uh, he volunteers his time. Uh, for firearm safety instructions, and he, he he volunteers his time, and he trains a lot of people at very discounted prices um, up there in Connecticut. And uh, you can send him a PM through YouTube if you're interested in that kind of stuff. He used to work for Winchester and Marlin in the research and development department. This is where he came up with his, uh, I guess, recipe for this particular lubrication. Uh, he told me what was in it, but it was like way scientific old man. I mean, he was like, oh, there's seven parts of this and four parts of A, B, C, D in there, and there's seven parts of Elemento G. And I'm like, oh, great. Now, what? So, but anyway, this is what he sent me, and it works fantastic as a gun lube. But I told Buzz, I'm like, look, dude, I'm not a gun channel, one. Uh, I just got old country dude guns, and two... I'm not going to just use it for a gun lube because it's got to get j nulled, man. It's got to, we got to see what this stuff can do. And he's like, all right, man, go ahead. So actually he did it with that Connecticut accent. Go ahead, man. Yeah, you go. So what I've been using it, I've been using it for everything. And here's my cotton ball that I just have left from when I was uh, cleaning my sidearm. This, uh, I've been using it uh, on my tools. Having said that, it is not food safe. So don't use it to clean and, uh, and oil your kitchen knives. Don't use it on anything that's going to be food, dog food, animal food. It's not food grade. It's not food safe. Treat it and store it as you would any other potentially dangerous chemicals. Keep it out of reach of children. Don't sit around doing shots of slide slick thinking you're cool. No, that's no. Not food safe. Okay. So... But what you can use it for is like I use it, uh, I just treat my, my Leatherman tool because my Leatherman is always with me and it's always in the weather and it's always getting beat up. And one drop, man, one drop of this stuff will just work wonders on all your tools. I'm not going to waste any more because I just oiled it a little bit ago. But this Leatherman is probably 17 or 18 years old, hanging on my side, falling down the hill, everything else you can imagine. And this stuff brings it right back to life. And like I said, I got my cotton ball here that I have left from when I was uh, wiping off my uh, my TZ there, and it still has the lube on it. And I just use it to treat my uh, my outdoor tools. Not quite enough on there, so I'm going to put one drop on my cotton ball. This is my old draw knife that is always usually left out in the weather, and uh, but it's a great knife. It's a great tool. I use it a lot. Uh, and I don't want it to rust away to nothing, so I'm just going to take my my leftover oils here and oil up my uh, my outdoor blades. You know, your my axe, my uh, my draw knives, my door hinges, the gate hinges, anything that's out in the weather that you want to protect and keep lubed. This stuff will work awesome for it. And you can see that it's lifting that stuff right off of there, and it's going to protect this blade. This stuff is really, 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 really good stuff. Um, Buzzsaw says that he will sell some, he will make some for sale if you are interested in buying some and helping out a patriot and a, uh, an American, a true American dude, um, then send him a private message on his YouTube channel. I will leave a link. Uh, I will try to put one here in the fancy annotations like Defrog Toad does, but it's probably not going to work, so I will leave a link. No, it didn't work. I'll leave a link in the about section down to Buzzsaw's channel. Go to his channel, 
click on the about part of his channel and then down there below it'll say send message and you can send him a private message and uh, tell him that you're interested in buying some of this slide slick uh, lubrication because it really is awesome awesome stuff I'm uh, if I was a super cool dude like Fred Hart I could do like a plate of truth but I'm not that good at reviewing stuff like this all I know is that it works and it works very very well and I'm happy 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 to have it um, and if Fred Hart could ever get a hold of this stuff man he's awesome at doing stuff like this but here in a second I'm gonna take you over and show you just how well this lube actually works with an actual demonstration on my arch nemesis the back sliding glass door all right we'll see you in a bit all right you guys we're here at my nemesis the sliding back door this thing is very hard it's hard to push and pull clothes especially for my children um so about uh, i guess seven or eight weeks ago it was pretty close to it i put two drops of this oil onto this this sliding glass door and just in the last couple of days is when it's starting to stiffen up again and we use this door a lot anybody who's been out to my house can verify that one this door is a pain in the ass and two it is uh, uh, has worked very very well when I've had this stuff on it with using two drops so I'm gonna show you guys you can see that it is pretty hard to open and close so I'm gonna put two drops on the rail here one and now we're going to push it through a couple of times so that those wheels can hit that lube and you'll see the difference and there you have it right there you can see it loosened up and now it is easy to open and close and it's easy for the kids to open and close and uh, they're not having to strain and you know poop their pants and all that kind of stuff when you're straining this anyway so there you have it. That's about as good as a demonstration as I know how to give on how good this stuff works, the slide slick uh, that Buzzsaw makes. So Buzz, thank you very much, one, for being an outstanding dude and a good patriot and a good citizen of our country. And thank you, number two, for, for sending me this so that I could give it a use. And uh, I will use it a lot, and I have been using it a lot. And I just love it, man. I can't say enough about it. So there you go, guys. Uh, like I say, get a hold of Buzzsaw. Um, uh, PM him on his YouTube channel. I'll leave a link. Y'all have a great day. Thanks for watching. God bless. The end. Buzz Buzz. The end.